What's up everyone, Average Joe back here. More gravel coming to the channel. Part 2 of the uh, new game on the channel, Gravel. So far so good, enjoying this game. Moving on to the next episode, that's what they call it. Ice and Fire. A little Game of Thrones reference there. A Song of Ice and Fire. Fantastic show, by the way. One of my favorites of all time. Except for Season 8. Season 8 sucked. Alright, here we go. Let's get into the first race of the Ice and Fire. I think I'm going to go with the Porsche 924. We've got two paint schemes, gold or red. Red's my favorite color, so we're going to go with red. Still going to stick with the medium difficulty. So I get a very good feel for this game. Then I'll bump it up. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the first episode of Gravel. There's going to be a lot more coming to the channel. This game's very fun. Very arcade type feel. Looks like we have one of those checkpoint races. Cross country checkpoints. Rally races. I see the Aurora on stage 2. Or checkpoint 2. So that'd be cool. Up here in Iceland. One of the homes of the Vikings. Snow, volcanoes, and geysers. When we look for extreme locations, we go to extreme measures at Gravel Channel. Dress warm, because today, Off-Road Masters is taking you to Iceland. Let's go. Got my parka on. Let's go. I keep hitting X on the starts because I think it's like the crew too with the turbo. <laughs> There's no turbo on this game. Just racing in the icy mountains of Iceland. Ice and snow everywhere. Nice little sunrise here. The volcano off in the distance, smoking. Hopefully that thing doesn't explode during the race. Kill us all. Should get some big drip points on this game or on this track with the snow and ice. Very fast. This game's just fun overall. High speed, good racing. Cool cars. Gruber, see if I can pass Gruber. So we get a lake right here, frozen pond. Gotta take it easy on that. Cut that turn a little bit. Try to take him, not take him out. I'll try to get him on one of these hairpin turns right here. He's got pretty good acceleration though. He gets out of the turns pretty well. It's gonna be easy on the throttle, on the snow and ice. Catching him a little bit. See, he just pulls away all the turns. Okay, we're back on asphalt. Let's see if I can take advantage, and I just blew that turn. A little drop off right there. Actually helped me out. He almost missed the checkpoint. That would have been fantastic. Just give me first place. Oh, come a little, let him know I'm here. I'm still here, buddy. A 
Oh, love tap. Oh, here we go. Gotta run. Gotta run to the inside. Rubbin's racing, Gruber. That's how it's done, folks. I just noticed, too, the reflectors in the road light up. Good detail. Oh, Gruber's just gonna overpower me. Oh, we can go eat. We're in that airport. I thought I heard an airplane. There's an airplane literally taking off as we're racing down the, the runway. To the finish. We got a first place, boys. Showing Gruber how it's done. Like a predator. Let's enjoy this race together and just don't stalk the prey sad. until he makes Audra a mistake Masters and then I take advantage. Week, always and only here on Gravel Channel. That was fun. Very fun. Not too much damage either on the car. That was a pretty good race. Up to level eight now. Here we go, race number two. Ice and fire. It's a smash up race, whatever that is. I'm still learning the different kinds of racing. All right, here we go. Let's see what kind of car I want. Looks like we got like SUV types. Look at this thing, a Bowler Bulldog. Ford Bronco. Get a little OJ action. There's the HRX, I've used that before. I'm going with the Bronco. Yeah, let's see with the original paint scheme. Yellow rims. The white Ford Bronco. The infamous white Ford Bronco. I still remember that like it was yesterday. I was a little kid. Not little. I think I was... When that happened? I think it was like 96, 97. So I was like 8, 9 years old. I remember I came home from... It's either school or swimming lessons. I don't remember exact. I just remember coming home. My mom turns on TV and there's OJ driving down the freeway in his white Bronco. <laughs> oh, that was the '90s. Was a wild time. Wild time to be alive. Kind of like nowadays. 2020s. Wild time. That's all I'm gonna say. I'm gonna leave it there. No politics on this channel. This is an escape from. Okay, smash up. I'm assuming I go through the gates. Okay. I see how we gotta do it now. You go through the greens. I tell you, they don't give you much time. They, uh, I thought I got that one. See, that's a, this is an appropriate time. Timing on that one. Got some distance. Yeah, barely made it through that one. This thing looks like a Jeep, not a Bronco. I see... I thought I hit the green. We're just hauling ass down the mountain here. Nope, nope, nope. Not gonna hit that one. I gave in to my fate on that one. There's no way I was hitting that green arrow. I mean, look at this. Okay, making up some time here. I'm assuming this is make it in a certain time too. Oh, watch out. Drifting around the turn in a Bronco. Okay, I got the I got the hang of it now. See, this is an appropriate timing as well. Give me some time to actually see what the hell where to go. Man, we're hauling butt in this thing. I'll get the two outsides. Oh, no, 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 no. I was going way too fast. Okay, these are good. This is a good sequence. This is not a good sequence. Just ruined my race. I was making up good time there.
Yeah, they're outside one. Oh, right to the middle. Split the difference. Split the difference again. Oh, no, 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 no. I missed the checkpoint. This one screwed me up on time. Finish is right there. Out. Man, I think that last checkpoint got me. Fourth, yeah. I think I would have been a lot better if I didn't made that checkpoint. I don't think it was six seconds worth, but I think it might have been put me up in third or second. Alright, that was a little different. I only got one star for that. All right, note to self on the smash up ones. <laughs> Slow down just a bit. All right, what's next? Checkpoint race, my favorites. Okay, we got the rally cars again. Celica or the Impreza. You know, I'm gonna go with the Celica. I used the Impreza in the last episode. I haven't unlocked the paint schemes yet for that one. Or deliveries. Had a little discussion about that in the last episode too. Make sure you check that one out. Here we go. Snow, volcanoes, and geysers. When we look for extreme locations, we go to extreme measures at Gravel Channel. It's a night race, Dress too. warm, because today... Let's go. Seems quick. I like these checkpoint races on this game. I think it's the best racing mode on here so far. Something a little bit different than just traditional lap races. It's my twin in front of me. My clone. There's some clone on clone fighting going on here. I just bullied him on the inside. Did not mean to do that. There's a little snow mound right here. It's gonna be my driveway this winter. Exactly what it looks like you drive through a tunnel. Hopefully winter's not too bad here in Connecticut. Last winter we had I had a mound of snow next to my garage that lasted until about April. We had a lot of snow last year. This is what my actual road that I live on looks like. They don't uh, plow it very well. I live on the side of a mountain pretty much. So there's always some iffy spots, especially going down, downhill. we go through a cave or a glacier. It's gonna be a glacier. Probably shouldn't have broke right there, but I don't know what I'm driving on. Can you tell if that's ice or not? Going through another glacier or mountain. Straight uphill. Second place is right on me, though. Got the Aurora up there. The Aurora Borealis. That's one thing that's on my bucket list is to see that. I could probably stare at it for hours. I know here in the Northeast you can see it a little bit, I think, on certain days. 
It's very rare though, but I think I I think I've seen it on the news where if you go to northern New England you can see the Aurora. Sharper turn than I thought right there. There we go, almost on. 86%. Got decent lead on second. He does catch me in the turns though. Spend my wheels a little too much. I think that's the end right there. And we got a dub. A dub in the Celica. Let's enjoy this race together and don't be too sad. Off Road Masters is One back by two, next week. Two seconds. Always and only Not here bad. on Gravel Channel. I don't know where eighth place is. Oh, DNF. That's why he didn't show up. Almost level nine. All right. Let's see what's next on the ice and fire. Another checkpoint race. What kind of car we got? Oh, we got the trucks. All right, learn my lesson. I'm not going to use the BMW. We're just going to get in the basic Toyota T100. Got the all black paint scheme. All black everything. These checkpoint races are fun. I know I just said it, but they're a lot of fun on this game. Oh, we got some sharp turns on this this course. Very sharp turns. Especially right there between two and three. <laughs> Little hairpin there. Two hairpins. Or I guess three and four over there by one. Bunch of hairpin turns. So we'll see so how the Toyota T100 behaves. Razors. When we look for extreme locations, we go to extreme measures at Gravel Channel. Extreme measures. Look at this thing. That's a beast of a truck right there. Maybe I should have picked the BMW. I said in the previous episode that I was waiting for a track like this. But we haven't used this truck yet. This truck's got some giddy up. Temporary fences. Everyone knows that's my enemy. Take him out whenever I can. Unintentionally, of course. Oh, come on, man. This thing's loose. What's the fishtail? You'd think with the weight in the back, with the tire, it wouldn't fishtail as much. Hit a little stone there. Let's have to get away from the wall, Joe. Okay, here we go. Oh, he the blank tried to turn me. Oh, he tried to turn me again. He did turn me. Come on, man. Barely made it inside the checkpoint. Here we go through another uh, glacier, a mountain. Just flying through it. Look at the speed. A jump right into a turn. Those are dangerous. Oh. Screw you, security. Is that LeBlanc again trying to take me out? Yeah, I saw the fireworks. I knew a jump was coming. Almost jumped in the first place. Drag race down the mountain. 
Let Baker know I'm still here. There we go, coming towards the conclusion of this race. 73%, but it's racing down the mountain. I think I need a top three, but obviously I want the win. I think third and higher you get two 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 stars. Here we go. Here to jump. Oh what the hell was that? Oh no. Well the game reset me. This is not good. My truck just did a nosedive. What in the hell? And we're gonna finish seventh. I was fighting for the win. Almost finished an eighth when that truck snuck up on me. Oh my god, what the hell happened there? Smoke, tussles, and adrenaline. Who knows why you'd like our checkpoint races so much? Oh my god. So we got one star when I was going to get two, maybe three with the win. Why did it nosedive like that? Like, it immediately went straight down. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, let's get into one more. The Porsche 959. Let's give this one a whirl. I still can't believe that last one. I was going to finish in the top three. Oh, we got a little figure eight action down there near the two. Yeah, I was, going to, I was definitely going to be a top three. And the jump had other plans for me, apparently. I have to go back and redo that one at some point so, so I get more stars. And geysers. When we look for extreme locations, we go to extreme measures at Gravel Channel. Dress warm. Here we go. Let's go. It's absolutely... Oh, there's a plane coming right at us. Oh, you can feel the turbulence off the back of it. That was pretty cool. I'm just going to run right in the back of Navarro. And then muscle my way in the first. And he clipped me a little bit. Gave me some drift points. It's like driving in Connecticut on the highways in the snowstorm. It's about how people drive up here. People have gone absolutely crazy on the highways recently. I don't know if that's happened where you're in your location, but I've noticed it up here. People drive just like how I'm driving on this game. I'm gonna jump there, set the fireworks. At least I didn't nosedive like in the last race. I was trying to shove him into the fence, low key. Okay, so there's a drainage pond, drainage pond here. Now we're back on some tarmac. Expanding my lead a little bit. I gotta make up for that last race. see them on the map behind me. So I got a decent lead. Nice little jump there. About 50% of the way through. 
Get some high speed points, some jump points. I swear this porch man sounds like a chainsaw. It sounds like someone down the road is using their chainsaw. Let me know if you hear the same thing that I'm hearing. I don't know where second place is. But that's none of my concern right now. Climbing a mountain. Oh, here's, one, here's that hairpin, that sharp one. There's the rest of the team down there, just hitting into the turn, so we do have a pretty good lead. And my chainsaw mobile. done. 87 percent. Just domination in the Porsche. Got some geysers going off. That's pretty cool. And I see the finish line right up there. Just gonna blow right through it. Easy money victory right there. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Let's enjoy this race together and don't How be much sad. they hadn't even passed the line yet. Masters is back next week, always and only here on Look Rabble at this. Channel. Here they come. 11, almost 12 second win. What a victory. Just a dominating victory. Got some new cars. Land Cruiser. New livery. Awesome. What a fun game. What a fun game. Alright folks, thank you for checking out this episode of Gravel on the channel. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment, and I will catch you guys later.